What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we have the Astral Radiance Build and Battle Stadium and for some reason I believe like the little build and battle boxes have literally the best hits in it and we are going to test that theory today. So will this Astral Radiance Build and Battle Stadium give us the good hits? Let's find out. This might be the last time. Nah, I was gonna say last time I'm opening um like astral radiance but i feel like i will in the future i think i have everything that i need besides obviously the champ actually just the top cards realistically speaking i need those um and they're really hard to hit so let's see i've actually never opened one of these before so let's see what we get it looks like an elite trainer box which is kind of cool wait wait a sec is there only two of these in here wait a second i always thought the building battle stadiums came at four Okay, I guess you get three packs, or four packs, okay. It's four packs. A whole bunch of energies. Some dice. Okay. Okay, and then you get two of these. So, that's a total of 16, no, 12 packs for like, I think I only paid 35 for this, and there are only like 60, so... Let's just round it up to 40 or 36 divided by 12. Dude, that was a pack. That's not horrible. Okay, let's do it. Let's go ahead and open them. We don't need this. Um, yeah, let's do this. We'll, we'll test out the packs they give us that are not in the building battle stadiums or building battle boxes first. Move all this crap stuff out of the way. All right, come on, Astro Radiance. You've never let me down before. You've always gave me good stuff. So only positive things to say. That's kind of... that card is destroyed wow all right well hopefully the hit isn't destroyed all right let's go baby we have a second energy dark patch pillow swine super effective glasses got a chat out oshawat hoot hoot ponyard puchiyana hoot hoot again reverse hollow and nice okay that's not bad we have a dark right v i'll take that as our first hit that didn't even come out of the uh Bill and Battle Stadium. So off to a good start. One out of one. Doing good right now. Asteroid is always giving me good stuff. So we're going to keep the train going. Let's see what we got here. I'm okay with the white code cards too. Because you can get double hits out of this. Meaning you can get a uh, train to gather card. Which I do need a lot of them. Hit powered on. Especially the Garchomp. Energy Lodo, we got a Quilava, Eevee, Heracross, Teddy Ursa, Mantine, Voltorb, Sudowoodo, and then an Avalug. So, no luck on that one. No luck on that one. We're still chugging along, though. Solid, solid. You got another black and white code card. And I'm going to get some Crown Zenith, too, very soon. So, stay tuned for that. I just have to figure out how to source it. That's not going to cost me an arm and a leg. Because stuff is getting pretty expensive nowadays. Um, and I have to figure out a way to like budget it into my thing. So I did the fossil. We got a Dark Tricks. Drift Blimp. Swin Up. Chat Out again. Rufflet. Ponyta. Cricketot. Spice Season Carry. And then a Magnezone as our hit. That's not really that good of a hit. I'm not going to lie. We can't get the hollows. We need the good stuff. Was that four packs already? I guess it was. This is our fourth pack. Again, it wasn't in the Bell and Battle Stadium, so I'm not expecting anything too crazy. Or in boxes. Alright. Let's go through this one. What we got here. We've got Fighting Energy, Temple of Sinnoh. Okay, we got an Earth Ring. Feather Ball. Ralts. Sneasel. Mischievous. Barboach. Scyther. Reverse Hollow. Gutsy Pickaxe. And then a Vespa Queen, which is pretty cool. It's a cool looking Vespa Queen. All right, now for the good stuff. We have two of the Build and Battle Stadiums, and these things go hard. So let me open this real quick. Usually, every time I open one of these, I pull something good. So let's see if that'll continue. At least, um, have in the past. These have been known to, dude. I just opened them. These have been known to have some of the best pulls I have ever gotten before. So I think these have the best hit rates. I believe so. We shall test the theory. Oh, oh. Wow, packaging. All right, let's see what we got. We got four packs. And then, nice. You have a Hisuian Samurai 
as our Build and Battle Stadium box. Pretty cool. Alright, let's check it out. Actually, let's, let's take a closer look at this. I'm pretty sure this is like, yeah, it's a pre-release stamp. And I don't know what card it's going to have, but I'm not going to open it. Alright. We continue. Hope, everyone, hope everyone's having a good day. Here we go. First start off with this Build and Battle box. And it looks like it's a good sign. We have a black and white code card with a fighting energy, a sweet honey. Crinidos, Pillow, pillow Swine, Swin Up to go with Pillow Swine, Chatot, Ponyta, Cricketot again, same print line, Psyduck, Switch Car Reverse, and then, oof, that's a rough one. We have a Cleavor. A Cleavor. Unluck. Just a regular hollow. Not doing too good right now. We have literally one hit, and it's a dark IV, and I paid 30, 35 plus tax, so like, let's say around 40 bucks for this box, so hopefully we can get some better hits here. Fire Energy, Gold Duck, Switch Card again, we got a Cricket Tune again, Send Up again, Naked, Petalil, Bergmite, Hippopotas, Hippopowdon, leveling up, and the, wait, what? Another cleaver? Got a cleaver non holler right this time. A little interesting there. Hollow rare, non holler rare action. Nope, another green and white code card. We're making a mess. This is messy. I'm sorry, I might just throw this on the ground. I don't know why. Mess with my mojo. All right, we have a Steel Energy Dartrix, Driftblim, Ursaring, same print line, Mantine, Scyther, Vasculin, Voltorb, Glemiao, Sweet Honey, Reverse Hollow, and a Vegilecki Non Hollow. Dude, what has been going on with my packs recently? I've been getting like nothing. I've been going through a bad string of luck, unless they just stopped printing the good stuff or just these are all reprints. I have no idea. But definitely not. My best openings recently. Don't know why. Water energy, wrist cash. That's a pretty cool, cool looking wrist cash. Temple of Sinnoh, Cranidos, Fullfish, Basculin, Uchiena, Glemiao, Yanma, Reverse Hollow Knock, Bad, and we got a Quillfish. That's our non hot rare. Alright, that was the first box. Here comes the second box. So, Maybe you don't get the best hits out of this. I've been getting nothing. It could be that I've just been getting trash repeatedly, but I've been struggle busting it up. I don't know about you guys, but let's see. What we got out of this one? Four packs. And this time we have a Hisuian Basque Legion. Pretty cool. There goes our second deck that we have. Alrighty, here we go. Going in, we have four packs to do this to hit something good to get us our money back. Will it be done on pack number one? Let's find out. Dum -da -da -dum. Solid looking. Ooh, that's clean as heck. Kind of. Maybe 9 out of 10. Got a metal energy, a super effective glasses, bronze zong, duat, better print line, looking like it. Drifloon, Sudowoodo, Combi, Ralts, Nicket. Nice, definitely a better print line, reading Greninja, and then a Hisuian Decidueye. So, I'm pretty sure the Greninja is like a $4 card right now. So that definitely helps towards the total. And this Hisuian Decidueye is pretty decent, so not too bad. Let's see what we got going on here. We have three packs left. Swing and a miss. We have a white and green code card. We can still get something good out of it, let's hope. Water Energy, you got an Oopsie. Hisuian Overquill, Kamado, Yanma, Hoot Hoot, Krikatot, Sudowoodo, here comes Reverse Hollow Slot, Kombi, I thought it was a Reverse Hollow Greninja again, but it's a Mantine Reverse Hollow, and then another Regilecki. All right, two more packs, and we're ending the last pack on a Pocky over there, so that's pretty interesting. 
I need that misty color. That misty color is actually cool looking. All right, I like it. Green and black Coke card. Green and white, sorry. Black and white. Darkness Energy, Drift Blim, Dark Patch, Pillow Swine, Oshawott, Hoot Hoot again. We got a Ponyard, Poochiena, Yanma. Here we go. Ooh, we got a Trainer Gallery, Flapple, and a Heatran V. Okay, not too bad. Decent hits, actually. Now they're coming. Now they're coming. That's about like a. Four dollar card and like a one dollar card, maybe two dollars right there. So it's like it's like, it's coming. It's making some back about a third back. That's not bad. Um, I'm gonna put these in a uh, put this in here like this, as well as a radiant Garninja. like that. All right, nice. Last pack, last pack, last hit. It's been an okay opening. I rate it like a C. Yep, it's, it's going to get a C for me. Not the best. The Building Battle Stadium, should you get them? Do they have the best hits? Maybe. Dude, look at that card. What the frick happened to that card? Hello? That's pretty bad. All right, well, let's see. Grass Energy, Per Ugly. That's not even me. That's like something that happened in the card. Zelf, Switch card again. Bronzong. It's a Bronzong that got just destroyed. It got pooped on. Got to rowl it. Oshawott, Scyther, Stantler, ooh, okay, that's cool. Reverse Hollow Reggie Steel, and then Ursa Luna, so not too bad. That's gonna be it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Stay tuned for more. We got some more good stuff brewing in the, the weeds, I should say. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.